Okay, so there is another Dragon Ball Z Kakarot DLC trailer for the last one, which, okay, let me stop saying the last trailer because apparently it's not the last one. You guys have commented and let me know, hey, like, there's still going to be like a whole other season pass worth of DLC coming to the game. So I guess maybe now my new question might be, is it, I guess, maybe more like movies? Is that what I would imagine? I mean, this is covering the end of Z unless I've missed an arc that they did not cover, which I, I don't know. To be fair, like I said, I didn't play all of them, but... Regardless, you guys have let me know that there's still more DLC to come with a whole new season pass. So I am I am actually kind of like curious because now the question I do want to pose is, would it just be based maybe more so on the, on the rest of the movies if they haven't covered all the movies yet? Or does it just tap into Super as like via DLC, which might be kind of weird? I, I don't know. I'm curious what you guys might think about that one. But they did drop another trailer. So I figured let's just go ahead and react to make that today's video. So I'm going to go ahead and just play this. Oh, I was gonna say it's just going through like those past, past ones, final episodes and season. Okay, I'm an idiot for it. Literally just saying it right there, in the season pass to the final one. Oh yes. Dude, look at baby Pad. I can't, bro. This is so cool. It's so it's so cool that they're actually covering this for like Kakarai. I don't know. I I would have thought they might have not even covered this to be honest, but this is dope. Oh my god, look at everybody. Don't forget Kakarot. I just want to see the fight between Goku and Vegeta here. I don't know if, I don't know if they would show more Ubi here. I love that they're showing more Pan, though. This is so cool. I love it. Love it. Oh, okay, they are going to show a bit more of it. Oh man, I, I genuinely cannot wait for this, dude. This looks so good. Again, it, it the fact that just it covers this part of the story is pretty cool. Hell yeah, it's February 21st. Damn, that's it. I was hoping they were going to show... I thought I saw screenshots. Oh, okay. Is this it? Yeah, I was going to say, bro, I could have sworn I saw screenshots online. Where they were showing off like the power up. Oh, they don't show it here. What, what am I missing that I don't have that? You're late. Cause I just sworn I saw screenshots and it was like his SSJ3 form. I think it was like Vegeta's SS2. Regardless, this is hype, dude. I cannot wait to, to play this. And honestly, I do gotta go back and just play those past DLC that I have been missing. I'm almost curious. I'm I'm kinda I kinda wanna see, like, let me see. DBZ, Kakarot, Kakarot. DLC. I went, I'm just curious. Maybe I shouldn't have put in DLC. I was going to say, I wanted to just see like all of the DLCs that are announced so far. Let me see. All Kakarot DLC released. Oh my goodness. I cannot type and I cannot spell. Um. Oh man. I'm hoping maybe we could just go off the Steam page here. Maybe I could just see it. Oh, they did cover. Oh wait, no. Is this, did they cover Resurrection F and Battle Gods. I'm so stupid because you're right. They did cover that, and I do remember that. So damn, how, what do they all have? See, Bardock, Winter World Tournament. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The Bardock, Winter World Tournament. That is a new one. There's the Trunks, so much I remember. And then, so basically, this is what Battle Gods Resurrection F. Am I stupid? So that's it then, right? I mean, there was definitely some others, I think. Maybe it's just not on Steam, or maybe I'm just dumb. I'm probably just dumb, to be honest with you. But, okay, so, like, there's still plenty of movie to cover, for sure. Okay, so, I guess I'd have to imagine the movies, right, would probably be what Season three is going to focus on. Again, I don't know if they've announced what. Let me see. At this point, let's just, let's just, let's just Google it. DBZ Kakarot, Season 3, oh, or Season Pass, whatever, or Season Pass, we'll just put 3. Um, let me see what it says. Let me see. Gamer has an article up. Uh, well, this is like from like last year, bro. Let me see. Look to the future. Oh, okay, so the possibility of maybe GT. Oh, no. Well, maybe GT. I mean, I guess I never thought about GT. Oh, no. I'm an idiot. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot Season 3 covering the events of Dragon Ball GT. Would certainly okay, it would be a big departure. Okay, no, no, no. I don't think they're going to cover GT, considering that GT and the whole thing of, like, canon and whatnot to, like, the anime and stuff. But 
It, yeah, okay, this is what I was thinking. It makes the most sense for it to be super. That's why I was like, it's got to be like super. I mean, if it's not the movies, right, for the most part. Um, interesting that they would do it as DLC. Honestly, bro, they could have just done that as a full game. Like, I truly feel like they could have just rebranded it and done it as like the next, like just the next sequel of the game or whatever and just make it all super. But I mean, I guess, hey, man, they could go ahead and go full on DLC to cover this, but they totally could. Um, but I also, again, I can see the movies being a thing, too. And I guess I never thought about GT, but I guess, you know, every almost every game incorporates a GT characters anyway, so maybe it's just dumb. So I, I'm dumb for me to think that they wouldn't do it. Many ways, non-canon to the manga, or yeah, to the manga. Um, lots of retcons and stuff like that. I don't know, dude. I would, I would rather, in my opinion, like, them just do, like, a super complete, like, a whole new game just to cover all of super, but... If that gets covered in DLC, I guess that'd be cool. I would be down for that, honestly. I mean, to be fair, I just want to see Super in the Kakarot like style and everything. That's, that's honestly how I want to see that. So I don't care how they do it as long as they do it. Um, but that would be pretty dope. And I'm not even gonna lie, dude. Like GT would be cool to see too. But I just I don't know why I see more of this happening than GT, and I see more of them covering the movies if they haven't already covered all the movies. Because I don't know why I feel like there might have been more than what's showing here, but I also just might be stupid and just don't see it or I don't remember. Regardless, give me your thoughts about this down below in the comment section. Um, you know, at this point, this is coming out. The day this probably video is going to go out, this is probably also out. So I got to find a time to play this. There's like a Nintendo Direct that just got announced. There's an Elden Ring freaking DLC that's getting announced. Uh, there's so much, so much stuff that's getting announced and it's going to get crazy for gaming within like this month and then the next month. God knows what's coming in the summer, if anything. But give me your thoughts below on the uh, on this DLC for Kakarot. And, and, and more so, I guess I want to pose the question of like, what do you guys think would be season three? Like, what do you think it's going to definitely consider for season three? And I mean, unless I miss anything, but like, I don't think it's like anything that's concrete yet. So we have no idea. It's all just speculation at this point. Um, but I am curious, like, what do you guys think would be for the next season for uh, DLC for Kakarot? All right, I'm going to end this here. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys on the next one.